back to the channel. It's Angry Gamer Girl here, and I'm with my husband tonight, Glenn. And what we're going to do is we're going to play SmackDown vs. Raw 2006. We're playing the GM mode. And she won't say it. I was waiting. I was using a dramatic pause, Glenn! So what we're going to do is it's Glenn versus me. Our brand versus each other. Whatever brand I am will be the best brand ever. Right? Okay. So do you want to do a draft? Or do you want to pick or do you want to use the uh, you know roster from 2006? No. So you want to draft? Oh, yeah. Right. Oh, yeah. All right, so which show do you want? I will let you pick. You're going with, You're going with Raw, so let me get SmackDown. And then let's go. Oh. First draft selection will be chosen at random. Draft picks will alter between the they two will. brands. Raw has the women's championship. SmackDown has the cruiserweight championship. Cruiserweights are in blue. And the Divas are in red. You are not required to draft all 20 superstars. Recommended roster size is 12 to 20. So, we actually got this idea from a different channel. Up, up, down, down. You know, those things. Since we're also big, you know, wrestling fans, we thought maybe this would be kind of fun to do. Mm-hmm. Ooh. We have... Ten million dollars? Yep. Good night, Batman. So, do I get to pick first? Or is that you? That's me. Alright. Of course. Of course you're going to go with John Cena. How long are you going to keep him? He's expensive, little boy. My turn? Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Oh. You want Batista? Uh, I, want, I want Triple H. Go with him for six months. So what you gonna do, home? Well, maybe build my... Try to build up your divas? Mm -hmm. All right, let's see. You know, I just realized. What? I'm going to do... I'm doing Shawn Michaels. DX, baby! Oh, no. <laughs> going with some DX. I think Lita needs her partner in crime. It only took Trish for five weeks? My bad. <laughs> Let's see. Um, I'll go with Batista. Are you building evolution? Might be. Uh. <laughs> All right. Well, I have I have an idea for an awesome storyline. You know, I don't get to pick out the storylines. The uh, you know cruiserweights as well, huh? Oh, come on. You're taking The Undertaker? No! Of course I am. No! You're building evolution for a great storyline. <laughs> you got all you need there. Even though you can't pick your storylines. Hmm. I know, that sucks. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go with Edge. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well... Yeah, might as well get the uh, Brothers of Destruction. Uh, and of course, you know who else I need? Christian. So you only have two uh, two divas? I'm working I'm just on asking. It. Is that... <sighs> well, so let's see. Got the heavyweights. Christian. Oh, that's your controller, not mine. 
Oh, uh, I guess I need to get some other... Ah, hurricane. You have the cruiserweight division. I know. I mean, I can go through and pick out divas, too, if I really wanted to. Why would you do that? I'm gonna take... I'm gonna take Ray. Kabooka Booka 619. I don't think that's his music in this, is it? I don't know. I have no idea. It might be. It's uh, 2006. Probably. I thought that was his only fucking music. We're being so nice here. Just let me get Rick. Keep him for three months. Woo! That was a week. Woo. Oh, well. Hmm. All right. Who should I pick next? Um, I have Cena, Lita, Trish, Taker, Kane. Oh, boy. Brian, you start building up your, uh... My boys! Son of a... Mm. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> you know, John Cena and Randy were my boys oh, in 2005. Four. Oh, okay. I'm gonna go with Kurt Angle. Angle breaker. Oh, did I put a knife in your plans? Sean was a cruiserweight. Christian, Ray, and Ric Flair. I think they're all they're all classified as cruiserweights, which is weird for uh, Ric Flair to be a cruiserweight. But. It's probably all by their weight and maybe. Which is odd, because you would think Shelton Benjamin would be a cruiserweight. Because he was so tiny, but... Going with Eddie Guerrero. Yes. Oh, wait. No! Figure it out when the time comes. Is that how you're... Is that how that's working for you? I don't know. All these people are either on AEW now or WWE, and you're like, or not, no longer with us. It's like, huh, a long time ago. I feel like I need to have some type of divas, though. Not really. My roster seems kind of bland. Um, well, it's 2006. Take it as you want to. It's not my fault. Fault. Already made that joke. Not <laughs> even funny. I'll keep him for five weeks. See how he does. Is it my turn? Alrighty, let's think here. I have Cena, Lita, Trish, Taker, Kane, Tori, Stacy, Randy, Shelton, Jericho. Oh, Chris Masters. Do you do you remember him? The Master Lock, yeah. Yep. He was like really like bodybuilder esque. Yeah. So he was perfect, you know, the masterpiece. Yep. Chris Masters. Going with Book of Tea. I dig it. That's your damn controller. Why? <laughs> I don't know why. Uh, let's see. Do you have a single cruiserweight? Yeah, I got four. Maybe five. I can't remember if Eddie was or not. Oh. I'm missing everybody except Randy from Evolution. I wonder where he's at. <laughs> huh. I guess I need some other heavy hitters. Um, I'll go with RVD. Keep him for three months. Well, hopefully there's no marijuana around. Maybe you'll keep him. Surprise, Matt. I didn't realize that you're missing, like, Matt Hardy and Jeff Hardy. Yep. But it's 2006. They were at, like, what, TNA at that time? I don't know if TNA was even, like, that big. I think it was. I don't know. I don't remember. I'm guessing that's what I wanted. Okay. We're three months. So. There you go. So what's weird here is that what's weird they have Paul London but they don't have Brian Kendrick huh yeah that's an interesting thought 
But they have the Basham brothers. Yep. Which are technically, in my mind, considered cruiserweights. Technically. Mm. But I guess not in this world. I'll go with Chris Masters. Okay. Alrighty. Well, who do I all got here? I got John, Lita, Trish, Taker, Kane, Tori, Stacey, Randy, Shelton, Jericho, Booker T, and Big Show. I'll add the afro. Alright, so you're on number 13. Mm -hmm. When do you want to stop? You want to do 13? I mean, we can keep going. You want 15? We can do 15. Okay. I'll go with, uh, let's see, who would I have here that make it good? Uh, Tajiri. That's cool. It was a different time. <laughs> uh, let's see. I mean, you have Eddie. Yeah. I'm going to sort by popularity. Pop of what are we? Pop of what are we? Oh, popularity. Okay. Uh, let's see. I might have six cruiserweights. That might be enough. Let's go with Chris Benoit. And keep him for three months. Well, I've got her husband. Might as well have her too. Well, let's see. Number 14. Eh, I'll go with JBL. Let's do three months. And then this is our last one. Yep. Well, then, Christy Hemi, it is. You're going almost basically a full female roster. Uh, screw it. Let's go with Chavo. Keep him for three months. I'm done. I'm done too. Who's this? This is Raw. Uh, you don't have. I don't think you. I think you can keep those vacant and let them decide it out. Vacant. So hold on. Or are you going to pick your? Are you going to pick your champs? Yep. Okay. She's picking her champs. I will let them decide it out themselves. Is this my roster? That is your roster. Need Jared for the WWE Championship? Oh. <laughs> oh. So you can't be a double champ right now. Nope. Alright, well I'll keep Jared show a thing. Jericho. It was a thing! I know it was a thing, just in the future. You know what? This man deserves the title. I'm giving it to him. And who will be your intercontinental? And then hit start, hit that's it. Hold on. Are you gonna keep track? Of course I am. Alright, so you're done. Let's hit start. I'm going to keep mine vacant. I will let the world decide. Who's the world? I would like to be the first to congratulate you on your new on your new position as general manager. Oh, thank you. As the chairman of the board, I want to make sure that you are well aware that the WWE is all about the fans. That is why you have a job, and your job is to grow your show's fan base. This will not be easy, as the other GM will be fighting for the same fans. At the end of the year, I will award the show that has the most fans with the GM of the Year Award, the highest honor a general manager can receive. If you need information about the day-to-day -day activities of a, of a general manager, check out JR and Taz's report in the weekly report section at your desk. Good luck. You ready? All right. 
We got the draft done. Time for you to go down. So next week, I get to beat you in the ratings. We'll see. It'll happen. So guys, the next time you see us, it will be Raw versus SmackDown. And I go first. And, hey. and we'll see who has the better show. Me. Duh. Everyone, thanks for watching, and we will see you next time. Bye, guys. Bye.